Yeah. Look, nice. Oof, nice. So you put more olive oil on if they don't get enough. Well, it depends. So they're you know, so sometimes the hake plant is dry. Sometimes mm -hmm. when they're fresh, they don't take that much water. Okay. That's why I want to return the toast. But my <laughs> daughter's got another idea. She doesn't want and to you didn't it. soak those in egg or anything? No. no. Just raw. I soak them. Yeah, you little, soak them in, in egg. Well, it's different with breadcrumbs. With breadcrumbs. Yeah, well, we could do some of that. We could do some with egg plants. I mean, some plain mm -hmm. and some with breadcrumbs. Breadcrumbs. Depends if you want to be healthy or not. Well, breadcrumbs and egg, like not it. as healthy. You know how to depends how you like to taste the more. You taste the more eggplant that way, you know? You taste the eggplant more. Alright, now we take it to the bladder. These really aren't that bruised. Huh? It's not that bad. We'll cook in this first. No, we'll do this. With flour? Flour first. Regular flour. And then the bread crumbs. Do you soak them in egg too? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't do it that way, but that's okay. You don't soak them in egg? No, I do it. So I don't put flour in. I just you use bread crumbs, but that's good. This is no. What is the flour on? Texture? Yeah. yeah. It gets some more, you know, it get the, the bread crumbs stay there. Oh, milk and egg. I don't know. One, one will be enough. No, I always put a little bit of milk, milk in there, right? water, you know, whatever. You need a bigger bowl, though, I think, Mike. Huh? For what? For the egg. No. Oh, small. <laughs> he likes to boss around in the kitchen. <laughs> They're not that many, half of them, really. They're not that many. You don't need a lot of Okay, wait. What I, I put up? I usually put two eggs. All right, put two eggs. That's okay. I'm going to use one and see how far it goes. This low percent, high percent, doesn't, doesn't make any really difference. matter. Either. It just goes in there. Just These are seasoned bit. bread crumbs. Italian seasoning. Some cheese. Ooh, oh, Parmesan cheese, cheese too. Yum. Just about. Yeah. Just about a handful. <laughs> Quarter of a cup. Quarter of a cup. Yeah. 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 This breadcrumb is seasoned, so it's got a, everything in there, so you don't have to really put any milk. Yeah, milk. right. Italian seasoning is what you have to use. This is just the white brand. Seasoning. Seasoning, yeah. Italian seasoned. breadcrumbs. Italian seasoning. Mm -hmm. Okay, put the okay, crumbs Okay, where's the egg? Yeah, where's the egg? Come no, if we, if we can fit all in there, maybe we should pour just a little more oil in here. Yeah, because this is going to be okay. First thing here, porcelain and a flour. Shake it up a little bit if you think it's a lot of it. Can you put that in a uh, freezer bag and shake it around? The breadcrumbs? No. No? Doesn't work that no. way. Not like shake and bake chicken? No. See, I like it to put it because the oven is going to be hot. Hot. <clears throat> this is mom's parsley. And her basil. And her mint. Is that?
Okay, we're working on the sauce here. We have what kind of parsley? Italian parsley, flat, flat leaves. Flat leaves. Flat leaves. Flat leaves. Flat leaves. And then this is basil. A little basil. bit of green pepper. A little bit green. You can use any kind of peppers, green, yellow, red, red okay. whatever you have. But just a little bit. Mm -hmm, just a little and bit. And garlic. And garlic. Now it's working this busily over small, here, getting this breaded. These are small. Small uh, cloves. Yeah, small cloves. So I don't know. But usually they use four or five, it depends how big they are. Okay. But these I'm going to use a little more. Because this seems to be very small. Mm -hmm. I like to smash a little bit because it gets yeah, let's the aroma. juice. Yeah. yeah, and then I chop it up a little. It's easy it's for good. me to do that one. You know? Mm -hmm. Makes it so much easier to peel them. Mm -hmm. Smash them first. Right. When you do that, because it comes off easy. See all the juices. Uh, put the oven at 400 degrees. Okay. And how long do you leave it in okay. for 400? Huh? 30 minutes? No, about 20 minutes, then on one side, and 10 on the others. You know, well, 10 and 10, 20 minutes. 10 and 10. So I put, I put this over here. Oh, wait a minute, not yet. One, wait till it heats up. Yeah, when it heats up, and then we put on 20 minutes. Okay, this okay. is what we're so looking at. Well, 10 minutes one time, and 10 minutes so another time. We're going to put in, we have breaded. Uh -huh. it looks like you're cooked already. Put it over and over, and then this is non breaded. This is healthier for you. Oh, okay. Obviously, because there's no egg yeah. or right. flour or breadcrumbs in here. Okay. So. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, garlic, garlic and the pepper are cut very fine. We're going to make some marinara sauce. Marinara sauce from marinara. fresh. Fresh mm -hmm. from Italy. No, from fresh from Rochester. <laughs> yeah, but this is the way the Italians really did it. Right? Just, huh? This yeah. is the way the Italians really did it. Speak really. to her in Italian and tell her. Oh yeah, speak some Italian. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to know? I mean, tell I me, know. tell me what you're doing in Italian. Sto tagliando il peperone verde. Oh. Piccolo, piccolo. Little, little. Così da un po' più di sapore. It's cute. <laughs> Sounds neat. <laughs> They give it more flavor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what, I, that, tell you, so you that's what I said. Yeah. <laughs> I'll let they give you more flavor. That Italian <laughs> flavor. I'm trying to, to peel, peel this. Is it soft? So enough? if you put on a hot water, the, the, the skin will come out real easy. That's what I did. Okay. I don't want the skin. Oh, so that was hot water. Mm -hmm. Just from the sink, not boiling or anything. No, it's just from the faucet. Okay. See, it comes off. Yeah. Oh, really it's hard to get the skin off. So you only put one tomato in it? Well, that's the only one I had in the refrigerator. I just this is going to be just an extra. Okay. With the with the can tomatoes. Yeah. Right. Something for the fresh. Stew. I use fresh yeah. Tomatoes. I use the stewed tomatoes. So long as I have this fresh, I'm going to put this in. Yeah. If you have fresh tomatoes from from the garden or from whatever you go, sometimes, mm -hmm. you know, in the market, yeah. you can put a little bit this. Now you're kind of chopping it up? Mm-hmm. Don't you touch yourself. <laughs> once in a while. Once in a while you get a little piece of Tomatoes, this tastes good. Small pieces. Okay, the oven is preheated. The okay, oven's preheated. Here goes. We're gonna put this Nothing. in for 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. On one side and then flip them no, over. No, no, honey, you put a bolt. Oh, bolt. Put them at the same time. For the same yeah. amount of time. For 10 minutes. 
10 minutes. One is breaded, one is unbreaded. Okay. okay. Timer. Timer. 10 minutes. Ten minutes. Okay, so now we have the sauce here. Okay, the ingredients. we can put the light, so we'll see what we do. Okay. Oh. Fresh parsley, right from the garden. Mm. What do you do with the egg part? It's in the oven. Don't worry about it. The other oven's heated. Oh, oh I'm right. sorry, honey. We forgot. <laughs> yeah, well, we can't put that on camera. I'm going to bring the pot over to you. Throw this in the pot. Not yet. Not oh, yet. Not yet. Oh, yeah, yeah. Put the oil on. Put the oil on. Put the oil on. Now, where's the oil? Huh. Right here. Huh? Oh, you have one. Okay, we can put this on there. You want to, you know, you don't have to do all of this because I'm making more because we're going to use some for the beans. For the beans. The pasta, pasta, pasta. Mm. Oh yeah, that reminds me. We got the beans going. We are they the cooking? Beans in there and they're soaking. Oh yeah. Just soaking. No, the beans are cooked. They're cooked now. Oh, they're cooked. First Already? to soak them. Took an hour and a half to cook. Are those cannellini? Cannellini beans. Cannellini beans. I love pasta fish. Now you're cooking, you you're to cutting the one? basil. You want me to cut the basil? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Go ahead. Do it. You can put another one here. Yeah, just crunch it up. And I'm going to open this tomato. You need help doing that? To open the tomatoes? Mm-hmm. Okay. I can do this. I got to get... I'm going to put on the containers because I just want to, I want to puree a little bit. I don't want to chunk tomatoes. You know, mm -hmm. there. And you want to puree it? Mm -hmm. Well, how do you puree it? Puree I'll it. I'll show you. This is a lot though, you know, for the eggplant. Probably not for two, but because the past was all, mm -hmm. I'm going to make it the same. Right. Okay, so usually two cans. Two cans for that, and two okay. cans for the other. This is a stew tomatoes. Yes. And so they're too big, so you have to make them smaller, right? Right, see? Yeah. You don't want it chunky. Yeah. Chunky. Too chunky. I'm going to keep it this so I don't want to put too much water yet, you know? Mm -hmm. Then if you need it, you can put a little bit of water. Now she's puring the tomatoes. Much so I can't rinse. Just a little bit. Just, I, little, just, just to rinse yeah. all the residue out of the can. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Can, can after can. Transfer it back. We keep switching. And of course we recycle. We recycle, right. Yeah. <laughs> recycle the cans. Okay. Next. Next. <laughs> Okay. Boiling. 
Okay, where's the... Oh no, I just fogged up the lens. <laughs> oh, you can use, you can use the... Excuse me. Uh -huh. You can use the fork. Okay. See, now they want it. doesn't get too much. Okay. Do you brown them just a little bit? Some more. I'll take one soon. Yeah, do that first. Turn them over. You just flip them over. And I'll keep Ooh, nice and brown. Want. See, they want to the brown very good because it's got the... Yeah. These doesn't brown them much. But. Right. Yeah, it brown's very good. That. Yep. Those are good. I mean, if you like what Perfect. the... Perfect. Yeah. What that... Those... So it goes back in okay. for another 10 minutes. Did now you set the timer? The yeah. Oh, I've got to set the timer. Timer for 10 minutes. 10 more minutes? So it's 10 minutes on each side. No, 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 10 hours. 10 hours. Go on. 10 minutes. I think 8 will be enough. Okay. Well, for 10, but then, yeah, that's what we remember, we checked all before. Okay, so now the sauce. You already put, put tomatoes in there? Yeah. Okay, so now here's the tomato, the rest of it. No, wait, wait, some of that's for pasta fagioli. I know, but we're making everything together. Okay. Because we're making the red sauce. Yeah, the sauce is the same, and if you only think, you could make with two, two cans or four cans. I'm using four so cans. So we're using yeah. four cans. Because we're making so both eggplant and, and pasta fagioli. So the little extra. Then we add the garlic. garlic. Put a little garlic in garlic. there. Garlic. Yeah, the garlic. And now we got to put the oil. So oh, oil? Oil, too. The yeah. oil. Okay. And then Why don't you let mom in here? She's tinier. There, there <laughs> I can the, see around her face. We have the parsley. <laughs> okay. Basil, then parsley. Mm, fresh out of the garden. That's a nice stuff. Tomatoes, onions. Okay. Should put the final ingredient in it, the oil. the oil. Is it extra virgin olive oil? Yep. So in here now we could put, uh, if you like it, some black pepper and salt. You gotta put some salt also. Yes. Because yes. If you don't, <laughs> I'm not gonna taste anything. Okay. Oil, everything. Good. But I won't put, I won't put too much. I'm gonna put the oil first. Quarter of a cup olive oil, okay. extra virgin olive oil. Okay. Because this is. And don't forget to put your fingers and lick it in there. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what that's the extra seasoning. <laughs> Italian mama. <laughs> I always do that. What are we using here? Calabrese. Huh? Oh, then how much salt do you put in there? Okay, let me get this salt. Sea salt, probably. Yeah healthier for you. Yeah. There we go. A little bit of sea salt. Uh, maybe well, a touch. Like big if you don't want it, you know, you don't have to put I it. love salt. You put in as much as you want. Mm, be careful with the salt. <laughs> you okay. have low blood pressure now. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay, just you a handful. Teaspoon, I think. Teaspoon. Not even a teaspoon. No. I think half a teaspoon. Okay. Okay. And, and this like now it's gonna. Anybody turn this on? Yep, it's all set. Oh, 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 oh. No, you didn't turn it on. <laughs> no, I thought that you would had help. The stove. Now, how long do you cook it? I I will put it when it's starting to boil, probably 15, 15, 20 minutes on boil. And okay. you don't turn it down and simmer. No. You just let it boil, hard boil. Well, no, no, you turn it down. When it comes to boil, I'm done. You turn it okay. down and let it. Put the cover on. Where's my cover? There he is. When it, when it boils. Yeah, okay. Okay, here we are. The sauce is cooked. Mm -hmm. And now tell me what you put in the sauce. What You added a couple of little things at the end. Put a head on the The sugar. Oh, huh. I put a uh, quarter of a teaspoon of sugar. Which does what? It sweet a little bit. Okay. Yeah. And then we put a, what's a quarter of a teaspoon of the the baking, baking soda. soda and take the acid. Takes the acid out of the mm -hmm. tomato. The tomatoes. That's very interesting. Right. Okay. So what are we doing now? What are we doing now? 
You got the two. Corn in there. Okay. Spray a little bit of olive oil on the bottom so it doesn't stick. Okay. Now you want to add? Let me get the scoop. Yeah. Yeah, you can come and do it. I'll do one anyway. You want to do it all quick? No, 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 I want you to do one over there. You do the first. Okay, put some salts on the bottom. Okay. Cover the bottom of the, the corning wear. A little bit of cheese. Well, you put cheese on the bottom. That's interesting. Because mm -hmm. okay. okay. we, we don't put in the sauce any. Okay. Sauce we'll put in here you want in this there. cheese too? Not that. Okay. Not that, yeah. Just parmesan. We started yeah. with the one that's got the bread. Okay. Make sure every eggplant gets sauce on top. Okay. How many is left in there? Six, eight. We got six. See how we can just slide them over. Slide one in there. So it will be. Hmm. Yeah, that will be okay. Smells good too. Okay, now the cheese. More cheese. Put the cheese on top. And the mozzarella. Now goes the mozzarella. Mozzarella coming up. Mm -hmm. One mozzarella. And mozzarella on top of the pans. Sure, I got all this. Mm -hmm. This, hopefully, it goes with my finger. <laughs> a little bit, my. What do you do? You bite her finger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. Not nice. Make sure you put the flavor in your fingers. But my finger, I clean up. <laughs> <laughs> I've been cooking with she you. She cuts her fingers. She doesn't need you to bite them. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. See, now we've got one chunk of tomato that didn't get, you know, yes. meshed up, but it's okay. Yeah. I gotta get rid of the bay leaf. Mm. Beautiful. That was good. Cheese. You can put as much cheese you like it, you know. Yeah. There's no doesn't matter how much. No. Little if or a lot. Like you more, can do whatever you want. You put a more if you like. Do you need the parmesan or the uh, mozzarella? Mozzarella. Okay. And the top you put it just a little bit more. You like mozzarella, you put them mm. on, you know. Love it. Okay. okay. So you put I it, know cover it. Crumbs. You don't cover it? 
No, honey, I, I, the, the oven is not on. I want to oh. do this first and then, you know. And you do it the same exact way? Do both. Well, I can put them on. The, the oven goes on 350. Yeah. And how long do they cook? Uh, about 15, 20 minutes. That's all? That's all. Okay. And you do it covered or uncovered? Uncovered. Uncovered, okay. Uncovered. Oh, you put Bailey's in the sauce and also and in the also beans. And also when I cook, yeah, when okay. I cook the beans. So here we're making the pasta fagioli. Yeah. Okay. First I soaked those last night. Yes. You remember that. Uh-huh. Then this morning I strain, okay. rinse, and put a six cup fresh water. Okay. Not too cold water. Because it okay. was, those were soak and it became a room temperature. Okay. So try to put the water not too cold yeah. in the morning when you put the six cup of water. Okay. And then you bring to boil. Mm -hmm. When it came back to boil, it just simmer. Well, this was one and a half, I think one, one hour and 45 minutes okay. altogether, boil. Boil. At a full boil, not, not, not simmer. Full boil and then simmer. Yes, yeah, simmer. For an hour and a half. Okay. An hour and a half. Yeah. And those are cannellini beans. Cannellini beans. Okay. And now I'm going to put the sauce in here. You can see, you know, when I put the sauce. Oh, you put it in the liquid. In the liquid. Oh. Right. Well, that's interesting. So it makes it kind of like the soup. Mm hmm. All right. Then I boil, I boil, boil the pasta. Mm -hmm. uh, usually, it's better if you don't put all the, the pasta in here because the pasta sometimes gets Dries sucky. It out. Yeah. yeah. You just cook the pasta, and you can get. Do you cook the pasta in there no. or separately? No, separately. Okay. And keep it separately. Oh, okay. You know. Okay. So Otherwise, this, it gets soggy. Yeah, so this way doesn't get soggy. If you want to freeze it, freeze it just the beans. And then when you take it out, you can always boil a little pasta. Oh, okay. You know. And just add to it. Add to that. Oh. Right. I want to get all of the the juice out of this. Right. Okay. I think I got most. <laughs> Looks like you got it all to me. Yep. Yeah. So this now I'm going to let it boil for a little bit. Probably five minutes. I'll put it in there. Yeah, because those, the beans are kind of cool. I don't know how it is, if it's kind of, if it needs a little more salt or something like that. Now, you don't put sugar in that, do you? No, no sugar. No baking soda. It already, no sugar. already the sugar wasn't in there. Yeah, it's already in. Yeah, because yeah. we put the same it, sauce. Yeah, the same sauce. But if you do, you do the same thing. You put it, you know, if you do separate. Okay. You will put it. All right. How is the eggplant coming? How the eggplant coming? It didn't start the boil yet, you know. It's still the cheese milk. The cheese milk. It's for the pasta. For the pasta. Salt. Salt. Water. And she uses the dittamini um, huh? pasta. Yeah, dittamini. When they come to boil, well, I can put the oil on that, doesn't matter. Just to put a little bit of oil so it doesn't stick. Wait for the boil. Boy. Yeah, so now this is to come. It's got to be a pound. Was that a whole box of that? That was enough? No, no, this was that a half a this box. This is a pound. Oh. But okay. there was. So you used half it of it? Was, I used some before, so. 
Okay. I don't know what it is. Probably they said for fun. But if it's a little more, that's okay because you can always use them. Okay. I'm going to cook it in match. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Two cups. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll wait for it to boil. Like two cups. Okay, let's see the final results, Mom. What is yeah. this? This is Ooh. one of bread, just mm. plain eggplants. No bread or no. Yeah. Well, it's got a cheese, yeah, but and cheese. And this is the bread. And this one bread. Ooh, the bread better. gets it, more. It absorbs the sauce mm -hmm. more. Mm -hmm. more. And the pasta is almost done to make mm -hmm. yeah, the pasta fajou. Prima. Ron's favorite. Pasta. Bringing the pasta. You know what I'm going to do now? I'm going to put some of this pasta. Some of the fajoule. In there? Fajoule. Just the fajoule. I'm going to put them in here. What does fajoule mean? Fajoule means beans. Oh, okay. <laughs> Pasta beans. fajoule. That makes fajoule. sense. Fajoule. Okay. Okay. I think I can shut that off. I'm going to put some of this in here and then I put a matcha pasta we want to use it. Probably we can use the pasta because everybody likes that. Mm -hmm. You know? Loves it. You don't rinse the pasta? Maybe it's a little too much. Let me put it this much in here. If you need it, we can always put some more. You know? Mm -hmm. Put a half of that pasta. So this way we'll have it fresh. If you want some more, you can always mm. get some more. Did you like a cheese in here? Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll put <laughs> some cheese. Yeah, it looks good, huh? Looks good. I don't know if you have it. I don't know if Dennis likes pasta fajol, too. Who doesn't like pasta fajol? <laughs> Who out there doesn't like pasta fajol? Is there anyone out there that doesn't like pasta fajol? Dennis, I like it. Hey. Yes. Do you like pasta fajol? Yes. Oh. Well, not this thick of this, Ivan. You put oil you cook, so Yeah, put a little bit of oil. Okay. And keep it that way. If they're way. sitting, you mean? Not yeah, if they're sitting, okay. I'll use it. Um, so this, this yeah. way doesn't get all yeah. sticky together. Yeah, yeah, okay. You know what I mean? Oh, and then you did put a bay leaf in the beans. Yes, I did. Yes. I didn't get that on video. Yes, I did. Okay. Still there or you took it? I thought I took it out. Yeah, you did. You took it out. Yeah. I just wanted to make sure that they knew that. Yeah. You didn't put oil in the beans too, did you? No. 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 Sometimes I just sprinkle a little bit, a little bit oil after you, okay. you put them in here, just a little. It's not in a bean. I put it. I put it in a sauce. Yeah. In a and sauce. there were six cups of water in the beans, right? In the beans when I and cook you don't them. strain them. You keep that water and you keep mix the, the tomato sauce there. into right. it. Make it soupy. And I put the tomato sauce in here. Okay. Now, if we want some more, like I said, if you want some more, we'll just, just add some to more, it. put some more pasta. Okay. But I like to keep the pasta this way so it doesn't get too. Yeah. So if, just in case you want to freeze that, you better off freeze that. Yes, without the pasta way, in it. And then yes. you can always have it. Okay, and that's how we make the pasta, pasta tastes better. You know? Thanks, Mom. That's awesome. Okay. All right, let's eat. Some, uh, you get the fresh mm. cheese <laughs> on the top, okay? Yeah. I'll put it on the table so you guys can put it. Actually, Italian meal. Okay. I just put a little bit in here because not everybody likes that. Okay. But they don't even know because it's not that much. 
they will not. It's in there. You know what I mean? But it's <laughs> giving them more flavor. <laughs> they can't fritters left and no. I know. 